The mechanical keyboards come in all shapes, sizes, and switch colors. Some offer a more tactile typing experience, some offer additional features to help with professional work, and some are advertised to give a competitive edge for gamers. While the tactile typing experience and features for professional work have been proven for mechanical keyboards in my previous video, how true is their better for gaming claim? Well, I have Corsair's K95 Platinum RGB with Cherry Speed Silvers right here, and we're gonna find out if it really makes for a better gaming experience. The first thing you would notice about the K95 Platinum RGB is, as the name implies, the premium quality of everything. The gorgeous metal plate has a brushed aluminum design to it, and adds some weight to the keyboard. On top, there is an RGB light strip that spans the whole width of the keyboard, illuminating the front and the Corsair logo. There are six macro keys on the left side, differentiated from the rest of the body by having grey rubberized keycaps. There's a dedicated volume control area at the top right of the keyboard with a mute button and metal volume scroll wheel. On the top left, there's a Windows lock button, a brightness toggle, and a dedicated profile switcher button. It also comes with a removable wrist rest that has a particularly interesting feature. It comes with a reversible magnetic top that features two kinds of surfaces. One is very hard and plasticky, and the other one is very grippy and soft like rubber. The cable is braided and terminates in two gray USB connections, one for the keyboard and the other for the USB pass-through. Corsair employs a floating keycap design to the keys, as to give the most distance between the switch LED and the backplate so the beautiful RGB lighting bleeds to the sides. Speaking of the switches, this model comes with the Cherry MX Speed RGB Silver Switches, where Corsair's Better for Gaming claim comes from. MX Speed Silvers are a new type of Cherry MX Switch that is engineered to be optimal for gaming use. To put that into perspective, let's compare it with the MX Blue. The model Cherry has always pushed to be the best for typing in office work, and is one of the more popular Switch designs. Let's make this fast. The noticeable differences of the Speed Silvers from Blues are actuation point, which is how far the key has to be pressed to register an input, travel distance, which is how far the key has to be pressed for it to reach the bottom of the switch, also called bottoming out, and the actuation force, which is the measurement in centinewtons on how much force you have to apply to the switch to bring it to its actuation point. The Blues feature a 2mm actuation point with a travel distance of 4mm and an actuation force of 50 centinewtons. It's pretty standard among mechanical switches. It also has a click functionality, where the switch will give a click once you reach its actuation point, a sound made by a white slider inside hitting the bottom of the switch. On the Speed Silver side, that click is missing because it forewent the white slider component. It travels in a linear fashion with a 1.2mm actuation point, a travel distance of 3.4mm, and an actuation point of 45 centinewtons. All of this just means that the Speed Silver will actuate and bottom out earlier and needs less force from your finger to do so. So let's go back to the live action shots. What does that mean in gaming? Well, it simply means you can press buttons and have it register faster than anyone using a slower switch. Cherry, having shortened that actuation distance and lowered the actuation force, made a keyboard switch that feels so light and so responsive it became too gamery for the normal typist. Every press is so light but registers so true that I can only find use for this keyboard in gaming situations. Doing typing tests on it was a pain in the ass because I can't rest my fingers on the keys without accidentally pressing a button. So for 9,000 pesos or 180 US dollars, would I recommend this keyboard? Yes. Corsair claims that because of the MX Speed Silver switches, this keyboard is better for gaming, and I can't refute that. But I think this keyboard is only good for that purpose. Typing outside of gaming can be annoying, and if you ever want to use this keyboard for that purpose, get the version with the Cherry MX Brown switches instead. So that's my review of the Corsair K95 Platinum RGB. Do you have any questions? Comment down below. While you're there, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and if you want to see more, you can check out my previous video which is about using gaming peripherals for professional work. Check back soon, I'll be teaching you how to clean your mechanical keyboard. Thanks for watching, bye.
check back soon. Ayan. Ito na yung sinasabi ko, hindi ma-check back next week kasi minsan nalilate talaga tayo. 